to our generation that after everything that has been delivered to us we are still the same if the lies of john wesley didn't have encyclopedia they didn't have commentaries in the bible they didn't have anything they didn't have a tablet they didn't have a search engine today you play a search engine every scripture you need comes they didn't have how did they manage to preach genesis to revelation and these people with such depravity still encountered god today we still talk of their testimonies we still share their encounters their encounters is our faith what is wrong with us john wesley didn't have a car he was riding on a horse but he would preach in eight different places in a day you have a car you are still late for church how do we explain this and you think god will come the way he came in their time no no those times they didn't have instruments yet they wrote songs that today we still sing what is wrong with us who bewitched us that today we come to church and the beauty of coming to church is just like that we just come and the moment we close we talk we talk and we leave where is the god where is that god that they encountered and their lives were changed forever where is that god is it not the same god that interpreted mene mene tekel to daniel is it not that say where is that god in the middle of the sea apostle paul should rise up and say the lost angel visited me and told me in the middle of the sea god was visiting people we are in air conditioned rooms he's not coming what is wrong with us because we have chosen not to meet him we have dishonored him we don't love him anymore we don't care for him anymore he's not our focus anymore we have only enjoyed coming to church and calling ourselves names my pastor is apostle this my pastor is reverend this that is all and yet we can't have the testimonies of old what a sad generation we go to google get some information and run back what a joke we don't even know how to worship we don't even know how to praise him we don't have a message we don't have an encounter there is nothing like that so i don't want to deceive you what your destiny needs is god we have the things of god and we have god we have been manipulated with the things of god for so long there are deeper realms and that is him there are people saying if this is true then then god should show himself to me i want to see god no he won't come the people he shows himself to were different from us and if i see an encounter if i see an angel then i will know you know he won't come angels don't appear to people like us bitter people like us unexpected people like us whereas we are coming to church and what we wear is more important to us than the god we are coming to meet angels don't appear to search people search through your bible daniel was in fasting without food without water then an angel appeared this church knows how and we know what we are looking for with god we know we want to see the the magnificence of him but let's ask ourselves who are we the people that saw the miracles we want to see today let's compare ourselves to them today i was reading some of the prayer quotes of moody dear moody and i was shaking you read books of toza you shake you say these were also christians at a point in time catherine coleman didn't know the number of days she was fasting you want to be a woman your your name will last beyond i said i was telling some people there are people who die but they lose their names before they die their names die before they die and there are some people who die but their names refuse to die you want to be a person whom your name and your works will live beyond you it's not this kind of life you come to church and you don't even know who you have come before it doesn't work like that people of god stop being deceived it doesn't work like that you want to have an encounter it doesn't come with just one a man declaring to you angels will come no how positioned are you what is your heartbeat what is your heart calling for so we lift up worship songs and you don't even know how to worship him and yet you were expecting him william Samuel entered los angeles azusa street ordered the prayer lord let there be a revival for weeks people will come to church praying for revival you can't try that in ghana you have to lead them to pray for things and not god don't try that in ghana your church will be empty because people are not looking for god they are looking for the things of god but the things of god has killed many people the things of god has taken people to hell the things of god has crushed many people it is god that takes you to the end do you know judas was part of those who were given anointing to go and cast out devils and raise the dead he cast out devils and raised the dead yet ended up committing suicide the things of god are beautiful men will clap for you but it won't take you far it is god that takes you far so sometimes he will try to test our heart with things he will give us financial breakthroughs give us peace a little give us joy a little to see whether we will run after those things or we will leave those things and come after him 
have you not read that seek ye first the kingdom and his righteousness seek god and other things will be added he is expecting that the first for you to have about him is him and then other things for you and this is the kind of church we have today people come to church and they're expecting other things and yet they don't see the track record that the people that go for god get many things they don't even pray for the things we pray for how can a man enter a city and all he led the city to do was to pray for a revival lord send a revival suddenly fire broke out what are we looking for as a church can't we see that is why god is not coming why are we saying we are serving him yet our problems are multiplied can't we see we are getting something wrong but who is there to say the truth who is there to come out and even if we preach the truth who will accept it unto whom is the arm of the lord revealed to there is something wrong with the Ghanaian church if we don't come back and some of you must give the leaders pressure that teach us the way enough with this deception teach us the way and then the leaders will come back and tell you that the way is Jesus prayer meetings are not complete until we call out God pour yourself into us prayer meeting is not complete there is a way the presence of God can fall on you favors will just come every human being that sees you will like you if you don't have God and you have the things of God you will suffer some of you are weak we come to church because if we don't come somebody will call us that's why we come but the fire and the zeal to pursue god is not there there is no revival on the land listen there are many oh, can discover her. there are pastors let some pastors go for one year without anybody sowing a seed to them they'll put the microphone down call a pastor to come and preach and don't give him a honorarium the next time you call him he won't come back again you tell you don't respect his oil so all of us together with yourself you too you are in church because you want a miracle so the pastor is here because of your money you are also here because of his anointing that is why we are here and we have left the god of the church aside that is why he's not coming he won't come until you begin to seek him and not until i begin to seek him we will keep entertaining ourselves we'll be clowns entertaining ourselves till jesus comes back thank god for our instrumentalists but there are some instrumentalists if you don't give them money don't play so the reason why we are serving God, there are some singers, if you don't give them money, they won't say, what a joke, what jokers we find ourselves in church. So if we come for prayer meeting, people of God, put your desire and your prayer request aside. Something is bleeding in the heart of God. God's heart is bleeding. Let's solve it. When we solve it, you realize that your miracle that will not take 24 hours. Let's solve that bleeding in God's heart. Can you imagine that we all run to Friday service and our desire is that today we are praying for a revival at a Kese, let there be a revival and that is why we are coming and we gather praying that god send the fire how can we move the hand of god i am a person who is real if things are not well i see things are not well let's mention it it's not well there are many people who are on the puppet preaching today saying they are doing the work of god it's the motivation the church is giving them if not they won't do it and if your worship leader is motivated by money and your instrumentalists are motivated by money and the backers are motivated by money do you think the worship going on it will attract god it's a joke if that pastor is motivated by money and you yourself you are motivated by a miracle do you think that service will show up the way we pray john wesley didn't pray like that no billy graham didn't pray like that that our prayer kaya paya they didn't pray like that yet god came they saw him they had an encounter with him have you not read the account of paul the bible says that when he went to asia and was departed the bible said and he went aside and knelt down and prayed gentle but yet that prayer was so loud in the spirit but we prayed the loudest in the physical but our voice is muted in the spirit we don't even know what you are looking for again you want to break out of addiction god is the only solution you want poverty destroyed God is the only solution. You want to break the yoke of disappointment. The reason why human beings see you and pass is because there is nothing about God reflecting. Can somebody see God and pass? It doesn't work. Oh, I will say of the mercies of the I keep asking myself, so can there be another Rehard Bonke? Can there be? Maybe there can be noise makers. Can there be kingdom billionaires one more time? The way we are fighting common titan, can God really trust us with billions? The way this generation, common titans, 10%. The way the church is fighting the leaders, can God trust us? Except that people genuinely go before him, that Lord, you are all. The hour we find ourselves